Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I wanted to talk to you guys about something. Now, as you know, Vehicle Legends recently had a barn hunt. And also, we got a leak of a potential barn hunt coming to CVT. And also, we got a barn hunt leak coming to Driving Empire. Um, number one, I will not be recording this weekend. I, um, will not be here to record. But, um, yeah, so there will be a barn hunt three or with all these three games this weekend if things go well and and that leak in CDT wasn't for two weeks, Driving Empire and, you know, such. But as you know, in Vehicle Legends, we just got the leak. So, um, yeah, I'm really, really excited for this barn hunt. Um, there, it's strange. It started with Forza Horizon 5, then about a year ago it came to CDT, and now Vehicle Legends seems to be copying Cardio Ship Tycoon, I want to say. And now, Driving Empire is copying them. But here's, there's one common difference that's making them all unique. Number one, car dealership tycoons usually different quests. That's how you get the parts. Which I'm assuming it's going to be the same this year, where it's not just find the parts around the map. Which I'm really hoping it's not find the parts around the map. Um, as a vehicle legends, it is a small map, and it's not as hard to find the parts. So, um, it... That one was kind of easy. If you guys haven't got that yet, I highly recommend you get it, especially if you're starting out Vehicle Legends. I've been playing. I've been playing it since when I started Roblox. I did CDT Vehicle Legends. Driving Empire was a game I just recently started like actually grinding for. But yeah, so CDTs will most likely be different quests. Driving Empires. I have no. I have no idea. I'm assuming it might be like you race. You race certain races amounts to get parts, or you get, you like get, let's say, get a hundred thousand dollars from racing. Yeah, get, add three, buy, buy three, buy three cars from the dealership. You know, stuff kind of like that. I I really have no idea though, because Driving Empire is not like CDT, which is like a tycoon. So you couldn't add cars to the dealership. Driving Empire isn't exactly like Vehicle Legends. The map, their maps humongous, and everything, and their cars are extremely detailed. Yeah, there's things about Dragon Empire are different from the other games. So I have no idea. CDTs, I have a certain idea. As you know, it's the Ferrari F50. Vehicle Legends, it's the Dodge Daytona. And um, I believe in this 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 next one, it's the um, Gordon Murray. You know how um, he had, he already, um, we already had this the non-convertible one in CDT. But then he added a Roadster, which is a different name for it. So, yeah. These barn hunts are going to get crazy, guys. Um, tell me what you think of them. And, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment if you have any comment on this. I'd, I'd like to hear your response respond. Talk to you about things about this. Because I'm really, really, I'm just wondering, what is Driving Empire going to do? And everything. So, yeah. Um, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment if you have anything to say. And, yeah, see you next video. Bye, guys.